Hey guys, Adam here. Um, today I'm basically going to be showing you some effects, really nice effects that you can add to your backgrounds. Um, some of them uh, are really nice, they will help you a lot. Um, for example, curves, if I, at the minute it has curves on it, and then you take curves off, you can see a slight difference, but it just it makes, makes it look really nice. Uh, gradient overlays, as you can see it makes a huge difference. Um, so it's basically like color correcting it. So if you've made a background, chances are all the colors are not going to be the same. This is obviously a wild exaggeration of what could happen um, because you'd usually hue and saturate it so that um, you try and get it all the same. Um, so for this tutorial, I'm going to be making it all um, no saturation. So you're going to go click down here on this half circle. Well, it's a circle with half shaded in. And then you're going to click hue and saturation. Um, if it goes like this, yeah, like that, you just scroll down, put the saturation down, and then it's all grey as you can see. Um, now this makes it easier to colour correct, um, makes it look nicer. So you're going to go again, click on the circle, gradient map, uh, drag this down again or whatever, click one, click on that you like, um, click overlay. And then you'll actually see straight away you've got a really nice effect going on. Um, and then you can just play around with it. Uh, click on the circle again. Curves. Drag that down. Play around with the curves. Make it lighter. Darker. You know, anything. I mean, you can play around as much as you want. I'm just doing this really quick. Um, so yeah, that's the that's the curves, the gradient maps, and the human saturation. So yeah, guys, this has been Adam. Um, leave comments on uh, suggestions for tutorials that you want in the future. Um, so yeah, peace out.